Welcome back to another On the Ice with Dan Onsell. And in this episode, we have center Nico Heischer of the Devils. And we're going to talk about the importance of that, finding that soft area in the offensive zone. And what are some of the tips that you do to get yeah. away from the D and coverage? Yeah, I think uh, having a guy in this soft area is really helpful. Like, if you get the puck to this guy, it's a really dangerous shot. So uh, the thing I'm looking for is where's the free space, where I have uh, time to have a quick shot. And sometimes when I'm battling in front of the net, like I just try to, at the last second, I try to get rid of my yeah. D, like give him a little push, and then I have maybe a split second for get the shot off. So that's what I'm looking for there. Well, I, I just want to add, Sal, sometimes you see a lot of teams as well as you, Nico, just do that high tip, kind of a set play. Is that when you think the coverage is real tight? And you're hoping to kind of fool the goaltender with that high tip, yeah, kind of that slap pass you get uh, in yeah, the middle? I think this high tip is uh, tough to defend because uh, you don't need much time. You just need a little piece of the puck, and uh, it's a dangerous shot too. So in the tip, obviously. And uh, it's just finding the space again. It's like finding the free eyes and uh, try, like, even like try to lift the defender's stick and put your stick available. like. Just do whatever you can to, to put your stick free. It doesn't need much, it, ju it just needs a little tip. So it's, it's a tough, tough uh, play to defend. Well, Nico, Dano and I being defensemen, we're looking forward to seeing you getting away from us here yeah. and finding that free space. <laughs> That's good. All right, Nico, we were talking about how important is finding that free space. They call, some people call it the soft area in the <laughs> offensive zone, which is so important because the coverage is so tight now. So just walk us through a couple situations where there's coverage on you, but how you get away from that coverage at the right time. Yeah, well, I think just uh, in the slot, it's, it's tight. Like people will try to box you out. And uh, the thing is just keep your legs moving. Uh, don't stand too long at one spot, like try to spin off the guy or just keep your legs moving. It's, it's making his job way, difficult, like, uh, way harder. So, uh, that's what I try to do. What I do is when Halsey has it on the half or half board, it's like the D is gonna line up on him, usually like this. Mm -hmm. They all line up like, here. Yeah, tries to, to block his shot. So I'm gonna like literally search a passing lane through his triangle. You're saying this triangle yeah. right here. Exactly. The D, there. yeah, D most times they go, like yeah. they don't pressure the half board guy, but they like line up like this. So I even look all like this. <laughs> then I would just try to tip it towards the net. Yeah. Well, and it's right, because as a D man, you know, I'm visually seeing where you are and it's just almost a comfort. I just have my stick here, right? Mm -hmm. And it's sometimes it's tough to be thinking, okay, where exactly is your stick to try to cut off that yeah, passing that's, lane? That's, that's what I mean. So. When do you make the decision of just redirecting it toward the net like you did there, or I have time I, to corral it and snap it maybe. Yeah, that's, uh, that's, that's, a, good, that's a tough decision because <laughs> sometimes you don't really know what's going behind you, but it helps like just shoulder check. Mm. And uh, if, but for me if personally, like if I feel I can have a good tip on it, I'm gonna tip it all the time. So say Dano has the puck, you're saying, like, I may have you tied yeah. up. Yeah, you like straight up. Yeah. So and he got it, and that the last moment that I spin off and shoot it. Yeah. So, so it's kind one, of a, a push off. And yeah, it's just, it's literally like. Right? For, you got to get away from the defense. He's covered. like boxing me out, like, he thinks he has me. Even like push off or even like spin away. So he has to do something. And then I might be open for split seconds, and I can have a quick shot in that. Good but stuff. If that's, yeah. if that's split seconds, all you need nowadays. Yeah, that's yeah. <laughs> true. Well, we appreciate you joining us, Nico. Yeah. That was some great no stuff, problem. great Thank tips you. for the kids. And uh, we wish you continued success. And Thank you. I'm sure they learned a lot from you. Thanks, man. That's good. Thanks. Thanks.